A Spiris is slowly trying to get back on schedule with postponed services and procedures for patients. Thanks for joining us. I'm Melissa Langbett. And I'm Phil Aldridge. This comes more than two weeks after announcing the temporary closures of some of their clinics. News 9's Victoria Saha joins us live in Wausau with the latest. Hey, Victoria. Hey guys, well, tons of non-emergency procedures were postponed because the hospital was preparing for a possible surge in COVID-19 patients, which then resulted in some employees being furloughed last week. But now that they're slowly getting back on track, let's go ahead and take a look at what changes you can expect. The announcement comes as the hospital is slowly trying to figure out what the new norm will be like. So we can start bringing back patients with complicated medical problems that need to uh, come back and see their, their provider, uh, bring back patients that needed surgery where medication is no longer going to be effective in holding their symptoms so that they can get the curative treatment that they need. Procedures and screenings such as temperature checks and questionnaires they have in place now will likely continue with regular services. We're looking at how we can leverage uh, uh, video visits and other forms of technology how we can safely check patients in and maintain social distancing, and how we can continue to provide those services and increase those services so people uh, can continue to maintain their health. The health system working to balance treating COVID patients along with non-COVID patients. Aspirus furloughed employees last week who weren't in direct contact with patient care. With uh, significant pain for us to have to go through and make those decisions about where do we provide services and, and who do we all need to be able to provide those services. So what does the reopening mean for them? And as our business comes back, it may look the same or it may look different. So an example might be as we transition to more telemedicine services, we may need more people to be able to provide those types of services. And that may be different than those who are on furlough. So it'll depend upon what the demand is and, and what the needs of staff are. Working to provide a safe and secure environment for your medical needs. Now, Aspirus will be contacting those patients who had their appointments canceled, and they also announced today that they will start testing anyone who is displaying COVID symptoms. In Wausau, Victoria Saha, News 9 WAOW.